Hi everybody. Hope you all have had a good week. Um, had a, I've had a kind of a rough week, but uh, you don't want to hear about that. Um, just work stuff. But uh, otherwise, it's been a, an okay week. Uh, but I hope you all have had a good week. Um, what I wanted to do is uh, do a little update on some kits that we've added to the stash here. Uh, actually, in the today. Um, one of these I bought at um, I bought on Shop Goodwill, um, which you all have heard me talk about that a lot of times, so I won't go into too much detail about that. But uh, and then the rest I picked up at Walmart today. So um, show you the one that we got uh, from Shop Goodwill first. I picked this one up. Um, this is an IMEX kit, uh, and it's a Harley Davidson. Lowrider, um, FXS Lowrider is a 112th scale kit. I think the ones I usually do are like 1 9th or 1 8th scale, but this is a 112th, so it's a little bit smaller. But uh, everything is in there. It, uh, all of the parts appear to still be uh, sealed in the bags. Decals look good. Uh, instruction book is in there. Um, so I thought that was pretty cool. Picked that up and then uh, inside the box was also um, two brand new cans of Model Master spray paint, Arctic blue and metallic black, and then also uh, a brand new unopened package of uh, Model Master liquid cement. So um, thought that was pretty cool. So uh, got some freebies in with my kit. So that's that's the kit from Shop Goodwill. Um, and so I went into one of our Walmarts today and, you know, I've been checking their clearance models for the last few weeks. I'm hoping that they would mark them down a little bit more. Um, and as I was in there, the guy was, um, the guy was actually marking them down um, to half of what they, half of the clearance price. So um, I got these kits for a pretty good, pretty good price. Um, so the first one I picked up is this uh, AMT 67 uh, Impala SS, um, and of course all of these are sealed kits. Um, so I, I do like, I love the Impalas, I mean I don't care what year they are, I, I just love the Impalas. Um, and so you can see the uh, the markdown price on it is 11 bucks. So yeah, pretty good, um, pretty good price. And then this is the one that really caught my eye. Um, and it's the uh, 1929 Ford Woody. You can actually, actually it says you can build it one of four ways. You can build it as a Woody, you can build it as a pickup. Um, it's got the little, it's got the little kit for the bicycle that you see in the back uh, there. And so I thought that was really cool. Um, so again, there's another one for 11 bucks. Um, and then, the next thing we picked up is this, uh, the Caldrag Combo, um, and it, so it's got a Ford Galaxy, a Falcon Funny Car, and the trailer um, are all included in this kit, uh, which I thought was pretty cool. Although, um, looking at the parts on the back, I'm not sure, one of the cars is a curbside, and I'm not sure which one. Um, but you know, still, for eleven bucks, you get two car, two car kits and a trailer kit. So I thought that was that was pretty good. In fact, I thought this was so good that I picked up not only one, but two. Uh, and so we added, we're going to add those to the stash. And then the last thing is actually not a model kit, but uh, they had they had these. Uh, cases, the plastic cases. Uh, these are the AMT brand, but um, these were, the clearance price on them was $5, um, and they had them marked down half that, so I picked up six of these for two fifty dollars apiece. I bought, I bought all of the rest of them that they had, which was six. So, um, again, you know, I've got, I've got three, I think, over here that I bought um, for $5 each. And then I've got six more that I just bought today for two fifty each. So, um, you know, not a lot of investment in these kits uh, or in these these deals. Uh, but you know, that's a that's a good bargain. So anyway, those are the stash ads. 
I uh, want to thank everybody for uh, for the recent sub, um, but I can tell you that uh, I've had a pretty re a pretty uh, significant increase in subs recently. I think 48 in the last 28 days or so. I think that's what I read yesterday on uh, my Facebook or my YouTube stats page. But I'm going to tell you the reason why. It ain't me. I'm not the one that is pulling in more subs. Where is he? That's the one that's pulling in more subs. With the shorts I've been posting recently of him, that's what's pulled in more subs. So, as you can see, he's a little preoccupied right now, and he just lost his ball under the stool. So, I'm going to have to go fish it out of there for him. So, you guys take care. Have a great weekend, and we'll see you on the next update. Talk to you later. Bye.